how to set up google ads conversion tracking for shopify hello everyone welcome to our channel and let's see how we can do it for this just simply open up google ads and over here click on the option of goals then select the option of summary under the conversions simply click on it then wait for it to load here click on new conversion action and then wait for it select the option of uh, track actions on your website here it would ask you to add a domain name simply add the domain name of yours and scan it then over here you need to scroll down and select this particular option which is add a conversion action manually now here you would require to select category a conversion name and some other options as well suppose uh, you want to track the purchases on your Shopify simply select purchase and you can name it up here as well After that select the values according to your needs and requirements and select all these options according to your preference Then click on done now after that click on this option of agree and continue Now here it will ask you to set up your Google tag simply click on setup and this is where it will take you now here copy this particular code and open up your shopify on your shopify select the option of online store then select the option of themes and wait for it to load then click on these three dots over here for your theme and click on edit code then here you get this particular option of theme dot liquid simply select it then right below this head option paste the code that we just copied and after that save it up and on google tag just simply close up this particular setup and after that click on this option of see event snippet here you get this particular code simply copy it open up your shopify again this time open up the settings of your shopify Select the option of checkout over here and scroll down till the very end and here under the section of additional scripts simply paste the code that we just copied and click on the option of save. After that open up your Google then close it up and click on done. And this is how you would be able to do it. I hope this video was helpful make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos.